Hey guys, this is Zach Jack Dan coming at you with a Marvel Legends Top 10 list for Top 10 Most Expensive Build-A-Figures MCU. So my rules for the Most Expensive Top 10 list is there must be an eBay auction with more than one bid. The auction was probably within the last four months and the sale price was the shipping price plus the price sold to get my total price. No buy it now, no make offers, so let's go. So for honorable mention, uh, I'm going to say the Sandman from the old Spider-Man 3 series. Um, this one did sell for $100, but it was a buy it now. Uh, plus, it's not MCU, it's, it's Sony. So I'm not counting this one because, again, there was no bids on it. It was just a buy it now. So number 10, we got Groot with 41 bids at $49. Number 9, we got Okayo, Okaye, whatever her name is, from Black Panther with 3 bids for $58. Number 8, we got Cole Obsidian with 12 bids for $64. Number 7 is the Gladiator Hulk with 3 bids for $68. Number 6, we got the Vulture Wings. Uh, for $76 with 21 bids. Number 5 was Thanos from the MCU uh, Avengers. Uh, 16 bids for $79. $87 for the Giant Man with 31 bids for number at number 4 here. $89 for Mantis with 19 bids. That's number 3. And number two, we got $97 for Ultron. That's 40 bids. Uh, of course, we're getting this one re-released to us, uh, along with that Thanos was also getting re-released uh, in the 10th anniversary boxes. And number one, we got the Hulkbuster, uh, again, which is being re-released. This one went for $100 with 23 bids. All right, guys, let me know what you think about this uh, YouTube video. Like, subscribe. Leave any comments and check out my other videos. We have a lot more of these most expensive build-a-figure videos and other top 10 videos I like to do. Talk to you guys later.